Oh, my life. Cleopatra coming at you. How are you doing, ladies and gentlemen? Today is Friday, the 21st of May, 2000, and dare I say it, 21. I hope you're doing all right. Mm -hmm. Out there in TV land and in the various Cheerio. bubbles. On site, my name is Smith. Hello. And joining me is the lovely, the director, Mr. Mark Watson. Hello, how are you doing? And the lovely and cheeky in the corner. I can, do you know, I can double whammy my angles here. You can. Oh, uh, Miss Adam's up there in the corner. Mm. Hi, Smith. With Hi, everybody. Hello, 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 hello. Uh, with our fingers on the buttons, connecting us all, ladies and gentlemen, heart and soul, to you. So, uh, Mark, how are you doing? Have you had a good week? Yeah, it's been a pretty Hi. good week. Apart from, Hi. I slept on one side the other day Hi, and my ear got blocked. And uh, like uh, I've just been disorientated ever since. Olive oil. Keep on, keep on losing hearing in one side. Olive oil, mate. Seriously. Like, one slightly, on. few drops. Aye. Yeah. 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 I got some special stuff. Ellen, yourself, how are you? Aye, super dapper. Any crack? Any crack? No, not no, really. No. no. Okay, well, ladies and gentlemen, first of all, what's the weather like? I'll tell you, what, it's bleeding awful. It's uh, a fizzly, pizzly, mizzly, drizzly kind of day with the wind. Uh, I'm not enjoying it, definitely not a drying day, and with no hopes of a drying day this weekend. No. Well, it would be a drying day if you had some cover because the wind would help dry it as long as the rain didn't go. Then you have better. to dry the cover. Same thing, chicken and egg, Mark. Well, not if you had like a shelter outside your house. I'm not going up a gazebo. There you go. Get you. That's your weekend sort of. <laughs> the weather's cack. Uh, what else have we got? Oh, by me. Have I got uh, my equipment, ladies and gentlemen? Well, let's check. Have I got uh, my uh, pen? Yes, I have. I've got my. Heathland's pen, that's the Heathland's pen. pen. I have the bits of paper, and I did leave like that. Has anybody got a drink here today? Yep. So okay, cheers. cheers. Cheers out there. So, first of all, as it goes, ladies and gentlemen, we'll do the old agenda. The agenda being a, a fancy name for basically the menu, if you yeah. will. Uh, what we're doing today is stop, but I want a moose boosh. I've already done that. That was the weather and that. Then we'll go to the, uh, the starter. Which will be the news, information, and thanks, mm -hmm. which is pretty self-explanatory. Then we'll go to uh, well, obviously between this one of screen papers. Then maybe for the second course or, the, or our main course, we will have our stroke activity showcase extreme to the max this week, featuring shop bought food and fanning mm -hmm. about in the countryside and in parks. Shop bought mm -hmm. food. Shop bought food. It's never been done, and it never shall be again. Uh, there'll be no activity book news because sadly. It is no more, Mark. He says, well, it is it's currently no more. Currently no more. Uh, we may have breaking news for you next week, but at the moment we are all storm and hoping for the best. But yeah, the activity book will probably do a couple of specials throughout the year. And the oh God, of regardless of anything, yeah. we've definitely got and a Grimmore bumper. We oh, we've really got plans. I've got, a I've got an idea. I've got an idea, Helen. Right, just yes. hear, us, hear us out on this. Right? You can't listening. let me finish a sentence, can you? Oh, sorry, sorry. Rip it up. I'll tell you what I talk now. Okay. <laughs> For the Christmas one, regardless of we've got fundings or what or not, yeah. right, instead of just calling an activity pack, whatever, right, let's call it the Heathlands Annual. Ooh. You know, I used to get a Christmas Annual. Yeah, yeah, Christmas you get a Christmas Annual, annual. I like that. There you go. Yeah. The free gift on the front. Oh, Highlights yeah. from the well, year, no, favourite things. Aye, aye, and little cartoons. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. Um, no, I do know. Smith can't find his brew. Where is it? We can bring back um, Mark's amazing Mark. Death of Clive. Death of Clive, yeah. Oh, yeah. We could bring that back. It was good. It was good last sec, that one. Yeah. Cool. Um, what was going on? As that? I was trying to say, oh, yeah, before, was it? Oh, sorry. Um, we may we have been in talks to reinstate the Heathlands um, newsletter, mm. which may take over in a slight way from the activity book, Aye. and we may chuck a few extra things in with it. Aye. But it'll yeah. be all digitally based. And do you know what we do with that? Because we're very nice people, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> so yeah. So um, I. So I think that's about it for that. That's basically what we'll do, some shout-outs and uh, maybe a couple of things up, what's coming up, some little changes, yeah. yep. stuff like that. So I can feel a disturbance in the force. Can we have some screampies, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> Who the hell's up there? What the hell do they want, Alan? So first in today, our right. green bubble. Ooh. Hello there. Oh, 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 I was going to say right. French. Le Bouble Le Bouble Vert. Le Bouble Vert. Vert. Good to uh, hear from you guys. So Le that Vert, will be today. Bordage. Bordage will definitely be Bordage down there. there. Robin. Robin, of course. Of JD. Course. Maria. Maria. J JD. Hi. Who else? Peter Bradford. Pizza. Yep. Lurking about. Hello, all. Hope you're having There's a good day. Somebody else, day. I can't remember now. Uh, I'm trying to think. Is Jamie in today? No. 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 Well, anyhow, if you're in the green bubble, hello. Hello. Uh, there's a hello all from Michael Aiken. Hello. Ah, hello. hello. Michael Aiken. Michael Aiken. Watching you like a hawk. 
It's good to see you, mate. And it's good to see you back as well. It is. Uh, hello from Purple Bubble. Hello there, Point hello. Bubble. Hey, hope you're all uh, Brian, I hope you're not making a nuisance of yourself. Has, has he stopped yeah. whinging yet? Oh, do you know? Aye, for all this, uh, you know, he's, he's bounced around, thought you were meant to be ill. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I forgot. But uh, I used to do like so big a lot of that. Now, um, did I did see on the front of the purple bubble in the door? Aye. Is it new? Does it say purple mavericks? No, it says purple badasses. And purple, it's purple badasses. That was done about a year ago. Really? It how have I, she came back, I? How have I never noticed that? Exactly. I know it's been there for ages. I did. I did appreciate that going it's into the purple bubble this purple morning. Purple badasses. Purple badasses. Uh, hello, Helen, Mark, and Spiff. Hi. From oh. Anthony, what have you had for your lunch? Well, first in, ladies and gentlemen, and... He did do the double whammy, by the way. Well, no, I'm not having it. I'll do the first part. And also, he's doing that from an undisclosed location oh. as well. He's he is, in he's in he's dark, not in Carlisle. He's not, I know, not. I've got more, I've got information, maybe it's a pep. So, Mark, what have you had for your lunch? I had today... <laughs> um, Chicken green curry noodles, oh, which are really nice. Aye. Available in the Aldi for thirty nine pence. That's thirty nine pence in no, Aldi. Thirty six pence. Thirty six pence. Thirty six pence. Thirty six pence. The Tom Young ones are really nice. Are even right. nicer. We should take anyway. some product. Players. And I yeah, and I had should. some of um, corporate sponsorship. The Bakewell tart that was made yesterday Simon, by right. Simon, I believe. It was made by and Simon. The, that was tasty. And the lovely volunteer Kelly. Oh, aye, the aye, lovely volunteer Kelly. She aye, is. Aye. So how much you have? the corner from us. Does she know? She does. Uh, I had uh, leftovers, but very nice leftovers. I had right. Slovakia chicken right. kebab, chicken kebab uh. in a wrap with um, salad mm. and sauce and stuff. Nice. Yeah, it nice. was. It was lovely. I had what uh, I've called the cheesy spam hammer. <laughs> Basically. Spammer. Spammer. <laughs> cheesy spammer. Uh, I've thrown so much of it. Basically, uh, a look at any cheesy sub roll with spam in, and uh, I put little bits of. Uh, you know you get that uh, Austrian smoked sausage cowie Ooh, yes. too. Bit of that in. Brown sauce with maverick, salt and pepper. So that's what I had. Very nice. For well, my a lot of flavours going on. There's a lot of flavour. Complimentary though, Mark. In the old uh, cheesy spam hammer. You know? That's cheesy spam Cheesy hammer. spam hammer. Uh, right, so no more are they get then, Ellen? Uh, yes. Hello, Spiff, Mark and Helen from fun. Mr. Matthew Beatty. Hello, Matthew. Hello, Matthew. Matthew. I hope you, my man, are enjoying. Avenidics. So how's the old um, modelling going? Well, it's doing good. Well, we had, a, we had a, we How had a, come there's no photos on the... On the well, we're, no, because we're now... Don't be previous. We, we, basically, what we do, we, we try to mum them, obviously. Like, yeah. you know, we haven't done it for years, neither of us. And it was so fiddly. Uh, there's a couple of... turned around a couple of places, but it's one of them, the, sma the small one, is there, ready to sort of paint and that, but it's given us a sort of... You know, yeah. practice. So next week I'll be taking photos. We're making a large. I was going to say you should time lapse it. Yeah, you know that. But no, it's uh, it's a lot fiddlier than I remember. But then again, oh. you see, the last time I did them, my hands was like about that was small. Have you got that like super glue with the syringe on the end? Aye, it's a fine. Aye, that, 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 that comes Spare? with the full thing. Huh? How many times did you glue yourself together? A couple of times. Uh, well, you know, there's about four. Uh, <laughs> uh, I, I glued a wing to my hand. I glued my fingers together. <laughs> I forgot how strong it was. So you can now be a burglar because you've got no fingerprints. I've got left. no fingerprints. <laughs> I've got any dabs, as I say in the train. <laughs> uh, yeah, so that yeah. was that was that's gone very really well. So look forward to that on Monday, Matthew. Cush thing. Uh, okay, good afternoon from Chris in Blackpool to us all. Hey, I'm so nice. All right, Chris. I'm loving our global reach. Uh, yeah. Because I remember we had we had we had Melon, Melon she was yeah. doing from uh, the old Canadian land. Truly global phenomenon, led phenomenon, phenomenon, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, I. So there we go. Uh, Alan, this. Alan is in saying hello, Spiff Martin. Bonjour. Hello. Hello. What, hello. What, what are you having for your dinner? Here we uh. Right, I haven't got a clue again. It's in the gods. It might be chips, as in, you know, homemade chips. Yep. Uh, with a southern fried chicken stick style thing. I'm so not really nice. sure what's going on tonight. Again, it depends. Am I eating alone or with Channel and Amelia? Don't know yet. So, but whatever, I'm sure it'd be... It's all up good. for grabs. It is all up for grabs. Uh, yourselves, what are you having? Mm, undecided. Undecided. Oh, I haven't cool. planned anything ahead yet. You well, when, I looked, well the, I've, when I've, I looked through the freezer yesterday, there wasn't a great deal of inspiration. Oh, I'll wait together to you then. I, I wasn't saying there wasn't stuff in there, I had to say it wasn't inspiring. I am, but that's like, you've got loads in, though. Sometimes you have loads, loads in, and in. you just don't fancy anything, eh? Yep, there's Do loads I mean? in. Mm. The, the thing is, I've, I've got plans and stuff afoot for this evening which are not set in stone. Hello. So, I'm going to have to... Do you know about this, Mark? 
Uh, I think so, yeah. Yes. <laughs> um, so I don't know when I'll be in or out, so we Aye. might just uh, like shake Check it all, all about. about. <laughs> Aye, it's Friday, might as well, huh? Friday, might as well, so might yeah. Well. Right, um, yeah. We'll make sure Eva gets fed early doors yeah. and well, we'll yeah, I mean, fed for yeah, ourselves. It's, it's always a plus feeding the child. Yeah. <laughs> uh, anyway. Moving on, Sarah Farmer is in saying hello, hello. Smith, Mark and Helen. Hello. And hello to all the Heathens Bubbles. Excellent. Thank good you, good. Sarah. Yeah. Hello. Good. Jeanette is saying good day from the engine room. Hello, hello Jeanette. Um, hello, Jeanette down there. Down, so she'll probably see us say, hear us say hello and then on Facebook it'll say hello in like a minute's time. Hello. <laughs> hello. Hello. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> Brian Jefferson is saying hi, Smith. I'm, I'm doing a picture. And how are you, Helen Markin? How are you, Helen and Mark with Helen? Ah, oh, good. Yeah, <laughs> good. Well, I'm glad we've played that one. I, I, I had to wrap my tongue around that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, oh, now, oh. next in is Miss Katrina saying hello. Oh, Katrina. How are you doing? How are we? I'm getting all the way from Blackpool. It's a day from Blackpool. Oh. It is. Good to hear from Katrina. Give us a text, Aye. Aye. Give us a, get, was that, is that the sign for text now? Get, get, <laughs> <stop>. <laughs> Give us a text. Is that, that's I a text. Know. <laughs> Uh, I'll just do two thumbs like that. Uh, uh. And no, then, it gives, a, gives a text. Next in is Mr. Tom Hall, Esquire. Hello, sir. Hi, Tom. Tom. Saying, how are you doing? And you keep forgetting so to tune in. Cool. No worries. We're all good. Back. Thank you, Tom. Exactly. Yeah. We're, we're available cross-platform. We are. <laughs> yeah. yeah. No, I've got to hear from you, Tom. I'll be keeping all right, but Tell us I'm what sure you're doing. I'm sure he's fine. I'm sure, I'm sure he's probably sat on his sofa. Alright, lazy of it. Thinking about playing computer games, but he's gonna have a cup of tea first, just True, in right. case. Maybe a biscuit, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna have I'm gonna go and ranch this Friday afternoon. So Jeanette is back in saying, I think I'm gonna have to change the engine room name to the Heathlands Arms, seeing as though I have a bar. Yeah, that's a And lot there of is just, rum in the She's got some rum in there, She has got some rum. She has an all. Just yeah. get some on draft. <laughs> I've just gone into a little daydream there. Best <laughs> best room on the farm, eh? Hey, definitely. Absolutely. Bit of windy pop, sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. It's just a And then a we've got Heather saying hello to us all. Hi, hello, Heather. Heather. How, How are we doing? doing? Hope you're well. Deepest, darkest, spender. Again, we're cross county and. Beyond? Into, we're beyond county. Beyond? If we were drug dealers, we'd be county lines, wouldn't we? We'd moved into Lancashire. It's all over the place. drug dealers would probably be doing this from jail. Exactly. Yeah. There you go. That would have a different ambience. It would, wouldn't it? <laughs> yeah, probably a different background at all. It wouldn't be a luxury <laughs> library. <laughs> Yeah, that. Bars and a grey one. Exactly, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> finally, um, Anthony's saying I've got good news. Have you? I'll be the judge of that. More than like on. Is this like good news? <laughs> good news, everybody. Good news, everybody. <laughs> I'm told the toaster to, to feel love. Go on, what? And they're end of the screen right. peeps for now. Oh. Excellent. Okay, well, it's a roller coaster ride off. Isn't it, ladies and gentlemen? So, yeah, news and info. Not much this week. Thought we might have summer, but uh, maybe, yeah, yeah. maybe next week. We'll have to wait until next week does <laughs> more on that later so as always a massive thank you to all the sites all the state all the staff working on site and all the bubbles uh this week we've gone raj with uh, with flags for the old union oh is that what it's for that's you. what it's for right i did wonder why there was loads of flags about. i did as well because i thought uh, especially there was thought we were maybe doing a fun with flag section no 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 that'd be good wouldn't it uh, we should do that but yes i saw no seriously all, all the staff Coming up with new creative uh, things for the guys to do, wasn't that? Yeah. And uh, I've just been looking, you know, looking around this week, having a what I like to call me pod peep. You know, pod peep. To, pod peep, going around the different bubbles, seeing what folk are up to, and that. Uh, very uh, proud of Mr. Andrew Bordich. He's doing lots of uh, again one of these things. Wouldn't have done it in the past because of the, the circumstances. We didn't know he's got right into doing the old. You'll know what it's called. It's like thread. Helen, what do you call it? Weaving. Well, you got no, you got the circle, and you're getting a newt. Embroidery. Embroidery. Embroidery, that's the boy. I saw he's doing uh, the Joker's face and uh, Robin as well. I seen he was doing the Hulk a couple of weeks back. Aye, yes, yeah. he's been fun, aye. So he's getting right into that. But again, all these uh, all these sort of ideas and that come from stuff. So big thank you to all the staff on site. And as always, all the staff working behind the scenes, both uh, making and putting together all the content we have for all our online sites. So that's the, uh, the sort of heat ones at home stuff we do during the days and stuff. Yep. And also the Facebook content and I'm going to give uh, an extra big old shout out to our very own uh, Maria who did a mm. second uh, exercise thing this week. She did a second, did. third and fourth. Oh she done she a lot She's got a few yeah. the same day. But because uh, I know when she started off uh, last week she was quite nervous as you would be 
Um, I had a little spy of uh, jiggling about yesterday when I was all on that by the pie. It doesn't sound right no, though. You, know you were I mean, watching that. her jiggle about. I was watching her jiggle about on the on the internet. Um, and yeah, and she's got confidence and stuff like this, but it, it is, it's yeah. a scary thing to do. Yeah, I thought the same. When I watched the, the recordings back this time, you could see that yeah. there was a little bit more confidence there. It was, um, I'm happy to do this now rather than, oh my God, there's a camera and in if, front if of you me. Think, if you think about it, ladies and gentlemen, up there in TV land, you know, us as support workers, whatever, it's a uh, very rare support worker is asked, can you go on basically live television? Or can you record a video exercise? And so it's a, it's a, a big tribute to the, the caliber, the caliber and the strength of character and the imagination and the skills of all the sport staff who work at Eflins who just, you know, step up to the plate and do it. So big old thank yous. Uh, what else have we got? Do, 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 do. Oh yes, I knew then. I thought I'd mention this now, even though we'll probably mention it again next week, Mark. Uh, yeah, go for it. Big thanks to all the, the guys who joined in with the Australia's deadliest uh, animals bingo yeah. on Wednesday. Now, again, I think we've said to you this possibly that's one we actually send out yeah. the it, bingo. It was. The, next, the next one will be sent out via email to those people who have registered. Right. Emails so, to we'll, us. what I was thinking, Mark, I'm just throwing this out at you now. Go for it. We've said, we've said to the guys, you know, we could send out the sheet if you like electronically so you yeah. can sort of. <laughs> Put it up on your on your phone. Oh, we'll have a stack here for people that do come on odd yeah, days. But for, for the people who don't attend at all, yeah. sort of thing, we can do it digitally. Now, it's just thinking. We do, we, we've sort of said how we do it. You can open it in like a painting yeah. app and cross it off that way. But we, could we maybe do a sort of an instructional video, maybe? Yeah. To show people, do you think? Just yeah. We, we do could that. do, but there's more than one device in the world, a type of device. Yeah, I yeah, know, but I'm thinking if it, you show them how to do it generally on an Android device and yeah. generically on an Apple device. Yeah. Um, I think it might be I helpful. think we can do that, Spit. Yeah, yeah, Should yeah, we look yeah. at that? Because we've got Munda. our little little like Munda. video and station Munda. in the art room now. Oh, oh, we? Well, we could do it. We could post it on either the Tuesday or the Wednesday yeah. morning, mm -hmm. so it was... Mm. Yeah, just I'm good for that. I just, I just thought about that this morning when I was in the shower there. I just thought it'd be like just a little helpful thing. So that, ladies and gentlemen, is based on using info, unless, of course, Mark or Helen have got anything to well, add on that Let one. me think. <coughs> and there is some news. Oh, go on. The new port of cabin now has doors. How's it does do? have doors. And well, does it work? Well, I presume so. <laughs> you see people going in and out of them. <laughs> I haven't got the hat. I could have done building news for Mike. Well, just pretend you wearing that. I'll do it. Like now, right? I'm wearing a massive uh, stove pipe hat. It's only in my. Do you know what? I'll just put. I'll just put a hat on. There you, so, go. There you go. In other building news, in, in isn't bad. Kingdom Brunel, 1842 <laughs> building news. Uh, so, as well as the doors being fitted oh. on our new new porter cabin. Mm. Uh, a lot of the decisions have been made about the finishes and the fixings and everything. So this week the internal Holy doors uh, have been ordered. Aye. The flooring yeah, has been ordered. They've decided the direction of the opening doors as well. Decided all the directions of the doors. There was that... a debate about this. The re... Honestly, there was. I'll Should it open that doors. way or that way? <laughs> this way or this Both way? Both have their advantages. How we get anything done is beyond <laughs> <laughs> uh, So yes. So the paint's <laughs> going to be on order for all the walls, and I'm ordering the blinds. That's building faff, isn't it? It is absolutely yeah. building faff. I was uh, in my wheelhouse. So it's contra contradicted to all the colours at all as we were doing it last time. It's all changed around a bit. I don't care. Because I've picked everything. <laughs> it's colours. It's going to be colours. lovely and bright. Excellent. And slightly minionish. Oh. So there you go. Nice. And okay. The Oh, the hat's off. The so hat's off. That. That's the right, end of that. In that case, <laughs> before we get into... I don't know where I am on my bits of paper. No, let's have a dig. All right. So I think we'll have a cheeky little way scrimp badge. See if there's a more. Do, 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 do. Who's else there? Oh. So, only a couple of comments. Sorry. Um, Jeanette saying, yay, Eurovision. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. yeah, yeah. Uh, are we still part of Eurovision? Aye. Yeah. Well, no, because Eurovision isn't about being part no, of Europe. No, exactly. I've said to you, they've said... The Europe, because people say, oh, take us in there, you know, possibly, you know, Australia. It's not to do with the countries of Europe. It was no. to do with the European uh, broadcasting. broadcasting sort of commission thing. Yep. Um, it's not to do with countries in Europe. That's why you can have, like, Israel in or Tunisia, which is in Africa, or Australia, yep. as I've been before. It depends who puts money into the pot 
Eurovision yeah, itself is a, if it's a company or whatever, a broadcasting company formed in 1955, I believe. I meant more because we are usually rubbish and end up down the bottom of this. <laughs> is it, is it's it worth like, bothering? It's the beach is 12, doesn't it? When I was a kid growing up, yeah. you know, 70s and that, there was about maybe 12 to 15. And then, of course, it all went south with the Soviet Union. So we've got, like, Lithuania and, you know, Estonia and all these boys. And then Yugoslavia exploded and then we get five out of them. You know, I'm not saying it's a bad thing. I'm just saying there's a lot of people yeah. there. More diverse, though. Well, well it's, we there's a lot. There's too much, yeah. Do you know what I mean? It's not my idea it's of fun my, Friday that's nights. That's why they have to do all these carry on before and with these other shows. There's too many countries. Did you hear Paula was saying that she records it so she can just fast forward to the interesting bits? Well, how would you know what the interesting bits are? <laughs> right at the credits at the end. How would you do that? <laughs> do you know what I mean? If you haven't seen it, shall I? I don't know. There we go. Anyhow. Anyhow. Uh, Anthony is saying that he will be back home next week. So, for his weekly phone call, Hi. You can phone mum and dad. I know, I told him that this morning. Well, he's yeah. telling you now. He just likes to cement it in there. Does <laughs> that? Hi. I said I'd phone you on the house phone so I could speak to the pairies. Uh, is there a holiday update? Have you done anything? I'll do it. I've got some on there, but I've got some We'll leave facts. that to the end. Some facts. Um, then I've put up a, a, a pinned comment about if you want to receive the bingo sheets. Hi. So people like Anthony and Joe at home, I know and you guys then, play hi. along. And uh, Alan. Alan. We have all got their email addresses already yeah. at the moment. We're probably going to send them out automatically, but if there's yeah. anybody yeah. who currently receives the packs, who won't be receiving them but wants to play bingo, yeah. please leave a comment or email yes. us on Aye. the email address that I I've mean, put up there. We're giving you plenty of notice. It won't be till a week on Wednesday to come in. Yeah. So I thought I'd mention yeah. it today rather than next week when there's no time. I wonder whether will. it's worth priming the guys who do the call arounds, like Johnny and Jane and that, just to, just to mention it. On the phone. Yeah, we've, we've mentioned it quite a bit. It's well, mentioned in the activity yeah. book as well. Right. Yeah. Good. Right. So, um, Anthony is asking, oh. what time do you get out of bed on a weekend? Never you mind. Uh, do you know what? I'll <laughs> tell you. I'm up every morning uh, at about 5.30, regardless. See, these two are proper early yeah. risers, uh, and no, I am used to be. rubbish. Uh, my, my, I am mine's dreadful. not a choice. Our little girl used to be up and go to school. <laughs> <laughs> well, 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 a lady ship has a little lie in that. <laughs> no, I'm normally, I'm normally up uh, early every day, but I don't mind it, and I like no, uh, the only, the only downside of getting up early is when you get to uh, like seven, eight, nine o'clock at night, like a night you're like right. you fall asleep. Well, sleep. that's that's what I do. I get up, you know, I'm, I'm asleep normally by about ten, half ten. Do you know what I mean? But still, I just like being up early in the morning. There you go. Yeah. I don't uh, like. I even went to say I've had uh, like maybe a couple of sherbets and that. And I don't say it like I sleep in to ten. I really yeah. feel bad. It's like a wasted half of me there. I don't. I, like do, I do try to sleep in on a weekend because like Sundays in my day to if I want to have a lie in a can do. Yeah. Um, but I just end up, as you say, lying yeah. in bed, staring at the ceiling, thinking, "No, I'm going to stay here longer." But yeah, yeah, just trust oh, yourself. Maybe you might as well get up. Aye. Yeah. It changes as you get older. I found you know when I was a teenager you know, early twenties, I could sleep into midday or whatever. Oh, yeah. Mind you, I wasn't getting in till six in the morning. Well, I was doing festivals and that. I wouldn't oh, right. sleep for the weekend and then yeah, sleep, sleep, sleep for the rest of the week now. after. <laughs> uh, Them right. days are long behind me. Long gone. Long gone. <laughs> uh, Maria is saying Brian was adamant that Rotterdam was in Wales today. Unbelievable! <laughs> Rotterdam is in Wales. There you go. Geography doesn't the, count. The hardcore. Doesn't apply. Um, capital of Europe. Uh, uh, Matthew is saying. It was my mum who lived in Life Up Drive, Spit. Ah, you said, no, you said, because it's around the corner from me. Ah, oh, right. Aye, uh, because I was saying, yep. you, know, you know, obviously, uh, Old Hadamay, the deepest, darkest uh, reaches there, and obviously the home of heroes. Um, and, uh, yeah, like for Drive, that's where, well, basically, that's where uh, you got your Steve O's and that, and uh, John Maguire's and that, but uh, I was saying, yeah. as long as mum mom used to live on there. I oh, salute you. you. <laughs> Miss BT. So... They rendered screen peeps for now. Cool. Off Shall we? Log on. Log on. What? Well, Why? Move on. They rendered oh, well, screen there peeps. The, 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 the okay, same way I wasn't clear. Some of it was happening there. I'm not, <laughs> not sure what it was, but there no, was some happening. But I was, I was you know, fully prepared to take uh, advantage of the situation. So, ladies and gentlemen, as I say, it's kind of a short and sweet one uh, today. But uh, I don't know about you, Helen. I don't know about you, Mark. I don't know about you at home or in the bubbles. But it's about this time of day on a, on a Friday like to sit back. Relax and enjoy our stroke activity showcase extreme to the max this week this week featuring 
shop board scrap and funny about in the countryside and parks. Whoa, and here we are, oh, I love this picture. So this was just a couple of days ago, remember when it was sunny? Yeah. Uh, there you go. We put the table outside. So the table's outside, and what we had, it was like the South Bank near Pont Neuf in uh, the, uh, uh, Paris. What's the Joker doing there behind um, Robin? Uh, Andrew put it there, so we've got... It, uh, it looks like he's using the urinal. That's right. <laughs> that's right. So we've got, uh, we've got uh, Chris and Robin partaking some of the frisco art. And again, look how happy Robin is. With the both are. Oh, yeah. the both are, right. Oh, but yeah. um, absolutely enjoying life. And, uh, and why not? Why not? Brilliant. Well done, guys. He's got a good collection of shirts now, only after he went shopping. He right? has, I've got 200, but I'm loving the waistcoat combo. <laughs> He just, Did you see, he's, he's, um, he's very coordinated today. The, oh, the waistcoats oh, matched with the trousers. Oh, I, yeah. I just must have looked at that. And then a nice bright red pair of trainers oh, to top it off. Uh, that's, uh, that's his talking point. It's an icebreaker. Right, what's next? Uh, this was given to me this very morning. Is that one of those scratchy miss, ones? It is. It's a scratch mm -hmm. and uh, colour thing. They're called scr and Annie said that as well. <laughs> Scraffitio. Is it now? They're called Scraffitio. You get a cream from that from the doctors. <laughs> All of that. Uh, yes, this is the, the lovely Miss Emma Farrell who thrust it into my face and uh, it's just to take a photograph today. Now, I don't know if the eagle eyed viewers are more, you can see nestling in the middle of that floor of display is a lovely uh, butterfly. There's more than one butterfly there. Is there? Yep. Oh, I, uh, I can see three um, at least. But yeah, so very well. I know, actually, seriously, I was having a look at that. The uh, right. What's the word I'm looking for? The precision. Yeah, the details she's, really. She's used on that. Because, yeah. I mean, you do have them, but don't get us wrong, you know, some at least basically hack all over them. But she's proper full of the lines on the side. I can spot I? five butterflies. Can anyone raise me from five? One, I'm going to say two, six three, just for the laugh. Five. No, five. All right, it's five. Five. Definitely. So let's just, bring, yeah, just, we've had it confirmed by uh, ex <laughs> external judges. There's five butterflies in there. It's no prizes. Just the taking part. And this okay. is Alan's bit of wood, I think. Tree, is it? Yeah, so, so uh, he's been painting at home this week <coughs> and we sent the picture in via Facebook Messenger on oh, the page. Right. Um, and that's there, Mark. Put it up. So, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I think Mark's got somebody in his eye there, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know if you can, you can see it. Can't it's probably see just it. as well. Um, yes, so they go on there. So no, I was just going to say, fantastic work, really lovely I details. Do. I, I can't see what's going on there because my eyes are gamming. Are, are things there labelled? No. No, no, Sorry, no, I'm no, no that, that is it's leaves, leaves, I think. Leaves oh, on the tree. That's one. It's very good. Now then, here we go. Right, now then, I'm going to just uh, clarify this. Yeah, entry, explain this see. further. So, you know, normally... It does look have, like it's been dropped. It does, not it? Normally we have people sending in phot photographs of food. They have made... Yeah? Well, this week, uh, uh, Ant and Joe, uh, normally on the Great British uh, Rudolph. The Rudolph. They're on, they're on Holly Bobs, innit? So, Ant sent mm. in... Uh, it's, I don't know what it is as well, it's an orange glazed donut. I can see. From Greg's. From Greg's, ladies and gentlemen. So, this will be the only time I'm going to permit shop bought food on the Art Stroke Activity Showcase Extreme Feature and Scrum. But we haven't got what Joanne bought to compare it. Well, this is it. So maybe no, it's, should we get it? No, is um. Joe not at home and Anthony's at, on holiday? She said that Joe. Well, are they both, said are both said, on holiday? I think they're all on holiday. I think she went to Sunderland or something. Right. I'm confident. Anyhow, uh, right. so yes, but it's a very nice donut, but it's shop bought, ladies and gentlemen. It's shop bought. Ooh. Here we go. New then, look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Ebert Davidson, nigger. And I'm not sure what one of that is. I can't say. Ex I think the, this must have been done the, yesterday. The, I do have a a, um, a name for this one. Do you know? What's it called? Again? I don't know. I want to find it. Emma's Black Rose. Black Rose. So this nice. is Emma's nice. work that she did off the back of Helen Walsh's. Um, blog post this week uh, about how to make paper roses. That was, oh, also, that was also in the DVD and activity book. And it was also in the DVD and activity book. So yes, if you, oh, go, right, okay. if you go at the Facebook feed, you'll right. find a link with Helen's with you. Helen's with post you. on our blog. It looks good, that, doesn't it? It looks how very cool. How to make paper roses. Like you should give it to I, Dean, he'll love it. Aye, it's on that. Aye, Next, Jan. Oh, right. There we go. Ooh. Oh, look at this. No. Vicky's, I think she's happened to a world of fashion in the corner there, is she? I think she is. She is, yeah. She's right. redesigned the Union flag. And it, let's face it, I could do it with a Mac over. You know what I mean? And uh, is that a picture of a dress to see, Mark? You know, yeah. It's yeah. Thing I think there. that's a dress that goes with the flag. I think it could be. I think it's a bit like the Spice Girl sort of thing. Remember that? 
They were all the range, 25 Now, if you look at that neat, nice, lovely, neat colouring with all those different colours, I can remember back in the day when Vicky started working Aye, with all us. All over the parish. All over the parish. D did not it, want to stay in the line, so no, that was her that's wish. Right, exactly, because it's patience, ladies and gentlemen. It's, yeah. it's taking pride in your work. So is that the wall of Vicky behind? I could it see is the a, wall of Vicky. Um, it's the wall of fashion. I see a little person from last week. Aye. And some of the other little bits oh, and bobs. Yeah. The so wall of that's fashion. Vicky. No, the Deeks and it's it's like it's like a a, a UK hip hop album cover. Yeah. This in it, you've got a you've got, got a break it to dance MC house. Connor in the front and uh, uh, Bordich. They get is that, is that Jamie? It, Bordich looks like he's about to do the teapot dance. Don't he? Aye, but uh, I think that's. Uh, do you know what? I didn't even know. The one who's I don't know where. Is that Goslin Sike? It looks a little bit like Goslin Sike. I think that's the Wild Life Trust at Goslin Sike. Maybe yeah, it's, it's where you go through the fence and the corner turns around. And Is that not up to where they've got the Lost Words garden? I don't think so. Might be, though. See, that's the part I'm What's going on here? <laughs> He's found an os. It's just like, I'm just going to have a bit of a relax. Ooh. See, that's, that's, that's I don't an os, please. Romantic... Um, if you'd have got that photo right, you could have made it look like the horse was walking down his arm. I'd be good. Ah, you sold me also. Ah, but it's a cap shot there. Good on Jamie. It is. I wonder who's behind the camera. Hey, man, look at them. Lads up to their good, there. you? You can tell how long they've been out, because Connor's got a tan. So we've got Tim's there, I can't see. Is that Jacob there, yeah? Jacob, Caroline. Caroline, look at them. Look at Brother and sister they are from there, yeah? With their flame-head tops. Push down. Look at that, I like that oh, that's one. That's a Rockcliffe. It's Rockcliffe <laughs> either one out. Definitely. And uh, I think I think Jacob's clapping at He's the He's giving someone around in the plaza. Well, it's just, you know, well, so, idea. Well, sunshine. Yeah. Aye. Out and about. Aye. Why wouldn't Connor, you smile? Connor sort of cotton plant the meaning of <laughs> life. A bit, a bit of a wander in the mist look about him. Isn't it? Aye, yeah. Charlie. Ah, it's that dirty. Yeah, Champion. Here we go. Here's Vicky. Not any more fashion. Say, ladies and gentlemen, look She's chuffed to bits uh, with her collage. I think this is like a makeup thing, is it? It looks like a lot of disembodied thing. eyes. Makeup bags and shorts. I think it could be a pastiche of fashion and modelling. I don't yeah. know, I like, but it could be a, and a bit of text that Shelby selects to me. Uh, but well done, Vicky. Nice one. There you go. Here we got a lot of Rebecca Gushley. Now what we got here? Can you read what it says there? Rebecca's, Rebecca's garden. I like Rebecca's flowers. Garden. We have created my dream garden. Dream Rebecca garden. at the bottom. Excellent. And again with Rebecca, she's getting involved in a, in a lot more stuff now. Do you know what I mean? She's doing lots of baking and things like that and colouring an actual project. She always has been a kind of a getting involved person. Oh, aye. Oh, aye. But um, nah, brilliant. Excellent work, Rebecca. Thank you. Here we go. The double whammy. Um, it's like, uh, it could be have these on the telly, you know what I mean? You, you, you need like... a bit of script with this. Who wants a cake? I do. No, the, <laughs> mine, the mine. But yeah, the mine. so this was the other day. Uh, I think with Nicola. And they made some little cakes there. Yeah, Vicky had the, the, the summer dress on. Um, I can see. Yeah, flowers. so, all right, so, well, but again, you know, stuff uh, that they're really enjoying and really getting into, and they're taking time and patience over it, you know, uh, which is good to see. So, well done, ladies. <coughs> now then, this, I believe, it's from Joy's National Flower Week. Joy has ever absolutely prolific. Um, just the other day, in so fact, when I first say Jamaican flowers, Jamaica, England rose, Aye. Ireland Irish clover. clover, India, it's the lotus, it's the lotus, the lotus okay. sorry. Australia, Australia. Oh, what's that one? That'll be the, uh, the Australian, the, the, the Australian rose. I don't know. I don't you know, I don't know the, the national Welsh flower of flower. Australia. Don't, don't Google it, just let it go and go I can't, and I can't. Uh, but yeah, but since you're like, nice orange still in the loads of these. Um, um, the and then the Scottish weed. Aye. <laughs> it's called the golden go, go. golden wattle. The golden well, wattle. Well, do you know what I mean? If you're going to pick some for your national flower, at least make it sound a bit more regal. Do you know what I mean? A it's golden like said, wattle. What's your national fil the filthy mess or something? I think Scotland have definitely got it right. A nice prickly thing that keeps people away. Oh, so Stay away. Yeah, hi. There you go. Mm. Aye, the um, Irish have so got the look. Well, uh, so anyway, well done, uh, join that one. Excellent, Absolutely. Week. excellent week. Ooh. Here we go. Look at this. This is. Uh, do you know what? I don't know. Are I they this could be the, the, uh, they look like rubbins to me. Oh, of course, yes, yes new. I Donna um, did a little bit sort of different. Uh, you know, bright mm. did the same sort of things and that. So what they did was this. They've got some crayons. 
uh, some bits of paper, and not just in the in the room, but the one who sighed, and took rubbings of different surfaces. He had different sort of patterns. Brian even did the base of his shoe. We made Ooh. sure it was clean first, though. And uh, what uh, what he did? So all these different uh, what do you call it? Bits of paper. Tech, that's the fellas. Yeah. Or patterns or whatever. And um, he said he wanted to make a robot out of it. So I said, right, you want to look up Gundam, right? Oh, Gee, Gundam, a bit yeah. of Gundam, the old Japanese Gundam wing. Uh, and then we decided it was a bit too complex. Um, <laughs> so we're not in it, though. So, but Brian's spot on and absolutely bob on to you for trying something new. Excellent work. Nice one. Dude. What we got next then? Hello. This is, and there this it is. is. Live like, action rubbing. Live action rubbing. Rubbing away there and outside, not yeah. a care in the world. Rubbing what handy at all? Which is harder than it's, uh, it's harder than you think. So do you know what the I'll proper name for, for, for rubbings are in uh, in art? Rub we've, we've had some graffiti on. Hang on, here we go. It'd be something fancy and it'd be French or something. Come on, what? Frottage. Here we go. Oh, well. <laughs> You've been frottaging, Brian. <laughs> been Brian frottaged. has been frottaging. So there you go. You see, every day, an opportunity for education. Frottage. <laughs> <laughs> right, yes, Malden Brain. Uh, again, well, new, is this another National Flower Week? Is this yeah. National Flower Week? I don't know who's done this. No, that one's. It's, it's a similar pictures, but in a different colour scope. It is. I think it's Joy again, you know. I don't know. She wasn't I think it on is. That. No, I, I can remember doing that. Great. I can't see any name. I could be happy, I don't know. Anyway, well done, it's you know. Good. The thing is, as well, they don't describe just names and all the time. I like to think that it's the whole group, you know what I mean? Yep. Everybody in the bubble, everybody on site, work towards a similar goal. Here we go, look at these. Armed drummers at the post office. No, yep. this is obviously... Taking uh, mail out of the post. We've got Jacob, we've got Simon there. Uh, a very important job, as you may know, or if you don't, I'll tell you. Uh, each week, in, in, in order to keep, to make sure all people who attend here as safe as possible, as well as all staff uh, being, having been doubly vaccinated, each week we go through a COVID test, like the proper ones, not them little tiny ones, the sort of more hardcore ones have to get sent off to laboratories. So we do that on a Wednesday and Thursday, and uh, the guys check out and you go to certain post offices, which called priority post offices, and send them off. So it's a brilliant uh, help they're doing that for us. So thank you yeah, very much, we, lads. We do the yeah, PCR lads. tests, which have to be sent away, right. instead of the lateral flow tests, which are supposed to tell yeah. you within 20 yeah, minutes or so. Yeah. But they're nowhere near as accurate. No. And obviously, in this game, we've got to be as accurate we as do. we can. Right, okay. So, no, uh, fantastic job, lads. Thanks for helping us out with that. There we go. Hello, look at this. Would you approach me, these gentlemen? Are, the they a, are they in a booby trap there? I think they are. It, it looks like some old robot like, was. <laughs> I right, so that's uh, Jacob and the old uh, Mr. Sean there, having a bimble about in uh, in some nice weather there the other day. That's Bits Park, isn't it? It is, aye. It is, yes. Aye. Hello, what was that? Oh, there's these young crazy bongos. That's the old Ben Gates creation, isn't it? Yeah. So that's, uh, that's a young Christoph giving so, it a laugh. Some of these things were built at or repaired they at were. Franklin's Farm. They were, yes. Aye. Yeah. yeah. Aye. So he's giving it, giving it large there. This is a late entry. Uh, it was, Sent in this morning to me. By Miss Emma Davidson. And uh, a nice soft focus. It is, aye, it is. Um, uh, a flamingo, if you will. And I'm liking that. It, it looks very, uh, what's the word? Flamingo y. Uh, no, yeah, that's the word. I think that's we, the word, actually. I'm, we were actually I'm, talking about flamingos yeah. earlier, weren't do, we? Do you know what a, a collective noun is for a collective of. I do know. Is, is it a flounce or something? A flamboyance? No, flamboyance. Is it a flamboyance? Do you, you know what, what's worse for a skunk then? A honk. Stench. Aye. Uh, <laughs> I, I like. Zebras particularly, Mark was like, yeah. you'll know this, I bet you do. What's the collective noun for zebras? Hang on. Stripe, hide, flash, monochrome, no. monop, I don't know. A dazzle. Oh, a dazzle camouflage, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. And oh. The panda was one that amused me. What? Yeah. A collective of pandas. An embarrassment of pandas. <laughs> a shan, <laughs> a shan of theirs. <laughs> hey, that's not. Um, yeah, so, Emma, um, I'm a Davidson, thank you very much for sending that in. Excellent, brilliant work, thank you. And next, ooh. Oh, oh cakey goodness. Hang on, we're dripping fudgy icing. Dripping icing. Yep. This looks like a multi-tipped, you said that carefully, multi-tipped Bakewell 
Zard slice. Mm, it well, was so nice as well. I had some for lunch. I had a chunk of that before. Yeah, this is what Simon and Kelly and I were making yesterday. Oh, for the better together group today. Oh, well, the well done for it's you, like, right? let's have a dance and then let's like scan some cake. Yes. Again, yeah. it's like Gant Alcoholic Anonymous and then Gant for a couple of pints after to celebrate. Yeah. But so, fair play. No, Simon did a really so, good so job. So they do the that. exercise, have the cake, and then they sell them rennies on the way up. There you go, that could be a fellow with that. <laughs> Mark up, sell them on. There's my weekend money sorted. No, oh, well, and that's Ooh, a close up. Close up. Yeah, extreme close up. It's a, it's a cake up. Mm. Um, I, I had a bit this morning. Oh, Simon did a really good job with that. No, that's good. Yeah. Now then, this is a, a knots and crosses board, which Mr. Chris Pinkerton well had, a, had a lot of uh, inputs in his space. I think you'd board. find it was bees and ladybirds. I well, you know, taking the place of the knots of the crosses. Yeah. But um, I so she did the old uh, the actual Jans. Jans, the toddies, if you will. But uh, the decorating of the actual board uh, it was Mr. Chris Pinkerton. Um, I saw that again with that later, actually. Yeah. Um, I think we need to do like a, an outdoor version. Let's look. Big one. Big stands. Or just use people. <laughs> just use people. Get no, that's too well, Should I get netball nets? We well, don't have to do that. Things. Just, just get to just I don't know, do that. Well, some people <laughs> do that. Some people do that. And you play some. <laughs> You know what I mean? Cut up the, the faff, you know. There you go. But yeah, Chris has done it. That's my idea, yeah. Chris did an absolutely beautiful job on oh, that, using the stencils on that. and that. It's lovely. Well you reminded well me of something that we did years ago then with that dancing. Right. Do you remember when we had um, John volunteering and we were making a, we were making a film and he, oh, he, he the was leaving? Oh, the wife's here! We, <laughs> dre we dressed him up as a superhero he goes, can you put it forward? Can yeah, you put yeah, them up and, like yeah, this? No, I don't know that. We had yeah. it so he was doing YMC, yeah. Yeah, we had it with into the, a YMC yeah. video. God, I'm not him. That's about 10 years ago. He was, eh? Oh, Ooh. Yeah. Oh, Peacock, Peacock! Peacock! Is this a Chris one? It is. Look it at is that. Chris. It is. Look at its flamboyant tufts, ladies and gentlemen. Swaying in the breeze, attracting its meat. Chris has done an awful lot of hard work on this, cutting out all the like. feathers and layering them yeah. up individually to get, uh, like, the peacock eyes. Now, again, eyes. this, again, showing precision and patience and whatever, I'm just splatting things about. Doing things a and, bit at a time. Yeah. And it is a skill to learn, actually, patience. It's, Do you know what I mean? Rather than just like look, putting a bit of, ah, oh, it's not finished, you won't, you know what I mean? It's taking your time, so well done, Chris, on that one. Like, if you look that, at the tail uh, feathers, yeah, if you look at the tail feathers, right in the centre of the peacock's feathers at the eyes, Aye. there's little sequins just to Ooh, like, that's catch the light. Uh, Flamboyant. It's lovely. Harken back to an extra. So thing. I wonder what the collective of peacocks is. A, squ a scrat. A scrat. All they do is scrat about and squawk. Alright, the show off. Hi. Fanny. So back to the studio, that is the okay, end. Well, of the thank group. you very much, ladies and gentlemen, mm. gentlemen for en uh, enjoying and joining us for this week's Art Stroke Activity Showcase Extreme to the Max this week, featuring uh, bought, Shop Bought Scrum and Fanny in a Boot in the countryside and parks. So, blimey, we haven't got long to go, I think. No, we so haven't. I think we'll do, i just double check. I'll tell you what I'll do, I'll do, I'll do the, uh, the shout, yeah, he's, no one. I've got a screen pipe, ladies and gentlemen, see what got. Oh, what the hell, ones? Who to do? Okay, so, er, Jeanette, ones, talking about getting up on the weekend and that. Who's this? Jeanette is saying right. she's getting up early tomorrow because she's going to Hexham Farmer's Market. Again, oh, get there, you've got then. You need to get the Holsford Farm produce, uh, uh, lamb. Lamb. <laughs> Quality <laughs> cheeses, too. Yeah, you've got to get there. Yeah, any, any sort of farmer's market, you need to be getting ooh. there first thing in the morning. Oh, 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 Jeanette, if you if you see cheese stall, I'm sure there'll be a cheese stall Coffin. there. If there's any Northumbrian nettle cheese, please grab me a bit, because I absolutely adore it. Well, uh -huh. that's uh, a feature <laughs> featuring shopping orders. There we go. <laughs> uh, who we got after that? Uh, next is Heather saying... She's been Hello. a bit fed up. Oh, she needs to have a bit more fun. It's the weather. It's the weather. Yeah, will be. She, she was very much looking forward to the cinema opening in Penrith. Oh, but she's ooh. been on the website and nothing's been listed yet. Blimey. That is a bit It's a bit rubbish. pulling up in a cinema and I've done yeah. it. <laughs> yeah. It's like, yeah, come in. On. Come in. They're, oh. probably, they're probably working out how they can do things. Ah, oh, it's very true. Do you um, see the view? We're putting the Lord of the Rings back on. Are they? Yeah. Oh, oh I thought you went the other day, didn't it? Yeah. Right. Um, yeah. So yeah, she's saying the thing, she thinks it's the weather. Um, Probably will be, aren't it, it? It's getting us all down. We want the sunshine uh, back. This is my prediction as I look into the mists of time. I reckon by June the twelfth, it's going to be lovely. 
There you go. There you go. And writing that down. Write it down. June the 12th. Write it down June the 12th. And we'll be going, it's too hot. Oh, you can't do anything. It's too hot. It's too hot. Do you know what I mean? We're never happy, yeah. Unbelievable. That's going on the wall, you realise. Oh, fair news. I can just feel it in my waters, which are considerable. So June the 12th is a Saturday. Oh, so we'll, we'll call it in on the 11th then. Yeah. Don't I mean? Okay, so moving on uh, Anthony is saying he's going to be back home doing cooking as of next week good man Excellent. very good look good forward man. to seeing what the you make the great British uh, Rudolph the Rudolph aye that cake last week was glorious aye. the size of that that was a monster wasn't it was that it the was gingerbread the gingerbread aye. the sticky gingerbread aye. yes uh, Mr Michael Harrington's in single hi Mike hi Mike hope you're doing alright was good Mike man. in on the football fanatics this week no. not sure Can't, yeah. I would see. have thought so it is aye. like his football aye. Aye. Hope you're doing well, sir. Uh, Sarah is back saying the Heathens bubbles could yes. could have been different. It could have been. Did She's thinking been we should have done Tardises. How's okay. that then? What, what, what time period? Explain really? yourself. Like, like for the doors and stuff, make a purple Tardis door, and then for green bubble, make a green Tardis door. What, like as the actual front door? Yeah. Yeah. We're not men, are we? <laughs> <laughs> we had talked about idea, sir, didn't we had I talked about doing these sort of things in the past, but they've kind of they've got like halfway through the designs and then something's happened and uh, we haven't been able to finish you it. You know what or, though, Spiff? Uh, I really like that idea for purple bubble because you know uh, the door that actually goes into the art room uh, as was purple bubble. Uh, that's like a a gloss painted white oh, door, sure, isn't right. it? So we said about the Tardis thing. I thought it'd be different time periods. <laughs> like you know, it's like welcome to Dinosaur Land. Uh, what about today? You're in, you're in Roman world. And as you open the door, it goes. Do you know what I mean? Right, I get you now. No, I do. I think, I think Sarah, we should challenge you and Mark to maybe to make the door into a purple Tardis door. I yeah. think that would look really cool. Aye. Right. Uh, no, <coughs> Tom saying, hey Spiff, I I've never slept the same since soon after my 30th birthday Aye, last year. Aye, well, what happened then? Talking about getting old. I know, it's true, man. It's true. Um, and he's saying, Helen, did you ever look up why they went through a phase on Red Dwarf of having no laughter? Now I forgot to it, look that, up. That, that was only through um, the film that they made, which got split into three episodes. Yes. They yeah. made it thinking that... Um, Oh, who needs laugh tracks? Well, Red Dwarf needs laugh tracks. Yeah, it does, I. It's really strange. Um, there you go. Mark has answered yeah, the question yeah. for me. It's really funny that because I've got tangentially uh, classic sort of American, uh, I don't know what you call it, drama, comedy, bit sweet. MASH, yeah? Yeah. Mm. Set the Korean War. <clears throat> now, the American version has a laughter track, yeah? Uh, because some of the jokes are very, very subtle. Do you know what I mean? They're not like da 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 and the, the found that the American audiences couldn't get it because they were that subtle. The British audience is good. They didn't have a laughter track when shown mm. in the UK. Right. The American versions had the laughter track so that the Americans knew, oh, that's a funny bit. I remember Mash being so. like funny and then like completely distressing at times. Oh, yeah, it was. Yeah. It was, yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, that's fine. So, yeah, so laughter tracks and stuff like this or live studio audiences. There you go. Depends Tom. on how they do it. I now know why certain episodes of Red Dwarf in the late 90s yeah. didn't have laughter tracks. They were made by different television organisations as well. That's, That's pretty true. Yes. yes. I mean, if you want to ask someone a Red Dwarf question, Mark is your man. He's probably watched them on... Is it Netflix they're on? Yeah, they only got to season seven well, or eight on Netflix. he watches them around. I, I swear to God, it's like um, a lullaby it's, for It's the kind of thing... It's a, a, well, I, I do, if I'm sleeping on the sofa, I'll put something like that on in the background because it's familiar, it's comforting. Yes. I don't, if I'm doing something where I don't want my full attention to be on the screen, I'll put something like it's that. It's like a little window into the world. <laughs> <laughs> hey! There nice. we go. Uh, Heather's saying um, it's lovely to see Vicky's progress with her work. Isn't it? Isn't it? Kind of it's super it? Heavy. It's it's you know, I'm, I'm in a, I'd say that for everybody. everybody. Yeah. Um, as I said, I said, I don't know what it is because we've got maybe we've got the table and sort of that, but, but they're just people are taking a bit more. So the time it's not rushes well, into the deadlines. The, deadlines the stuff in ratios are completely different yeah. as well. You have, yeah. You're not yeah. stuck exactly. to one to four. Yeah. It's whoever's in, whoever yeah. that kind of thing. And, and Heather's also saying that she thinks the flowers, flowers the second lot of flowers, were, were done, done by Abby. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Heather. Thank you. Well. Good yeah. memory. Um, Anthony's saying, next time I go away, I'll take you and Mark on a holiday. What about me? What about me? Just left here on 
Helena Well, you and Mark could have been Spiff and Mark. Oh, who is the you and Mark mean? No, no, it does definitely say Helena Mark. Ah, oh, way. There you go. Safe feminism. Right. Thank you for the offer, Anthony. Um, Depends where you're going, I suppose. I feel like. If you have somebody you don't want to go, I'll spend it for the other. There you go. That's right, yeah. <laughs> And Green Bubble are saying that they're enjoying watching us from Kaylee, Robin, and Dean. Oh, oh good. Good to see. We have to play. Yeah, I think oh, there's one just yeah, in there, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Was that? Oh. There's one just Alan, Alan's oh. saying the sound's, sound's gone, gone funny. Was it? Oh, oh, well. Is that on everybody's? Oh, it's maybe just on Alan's. Oh, oh no, and Anthony thinks, Spiff, you can come too. Thank you, Anthony. There you go. Thank you. Excellent. Well, it doesn't really matter if the sound's gone funny because we're only going to go for three minutes now. So I'll just do a quick uh, sort of recap on the shares. Just, just a few uh, for the people that have got in touch. Anthony and, and Joe, obviously, on holiday. On holiday in the moment to the Yorkshire Dales, Ooh. where it nice. is rainy. I would have I think thought that's uh, for most of the country. Uh, yes, yes uh, because I had a little visit to Sunderland. Obviously, went up the coast a bit there. It's maybe a little wee travel on holiday. Um, and, and tonight, I can confirm... For the, for the tea, struck up with their fishing ships. Lovely. Yeah. Lovely. Uh, got in touch with David and Sammy. David, David, uh, anyways, guess what he was doing this morning? Mopping the bathroom floor. Ooh. Well done, that man. I'll just, and, uh, I'll just kind of watch it through the messages coming in. Some of them saying echoing. Oh, right. uh, Facebook has done this before. Yeah. Uh, at certain points throughout the broadcast, for some reason, it starts echoing. Uh, it doesn't seem to be from our end. No. It's nothing we're doing different or changing. Yeah. So it just seems we apologise if that's happening. But, 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 it, it, it is happening. <laughs> Here we go, old Yeah, so, yeah, there has been some, some, some mopping up the old uh, bathroom and a bit of washing. David Smart, my absolute nemesis, is doing fantastic. Uh, when I phoned him up, I uh, spoke to uh, one of his staff, you know what I mean, one of his servants, they were and, and she goes, I'll just get in for you. And then the door opened, the dean chopped the boot. And uh, kissed him the phone, and uh, in the background, Wham was blasting. Wham? Uh, Which one? Wham? 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 Uh, what else have we got? Uh, Glenn's doing all right. And today, ladies and gentlemen, I can confirm Glenn had from his mansion a corned beef and pickle sandwich. Oh, nice. What kind of pickles? Uh, Say, the, the word pickle comes up and my, know, my interest you know, is instantly peaked. Has he had his job yet? Is he thinking of coming back? Uh, I think it's his first one. Oh, okay. um, I think he's waiting for his second new. No. I have got some quite distressing news for the staff of Heathlands. Uh -oh. Uh, so to Jack, um, Jack, Jack Maxfield, and his uh, his uh, mum uh, this morning, and Mark. I'm sorry to tell you this, and I'm sorry to tell you all the stuff we're watching. Jack might be coming back. I know, I know, I know. We had a good run, Mark. No, so you better to see him. So I think he's he's mum. So he, he spent his first few weeks of non lockdown in the pub. Oh, he's been in the pub. Uh, and now he's decided to come back. That's it. He's he's been in the pub. He's been in the pub. He's probably spent his savings. Not especially now. You know, he's been gagging and sitting and that. But yes, I just saw one all staff. Jack Maxfield's. Got to be uh, coming back. I'm not sure. I genuinely miss the look alike he's had. It's absolutely brilliant lunches. Oh, it's the look of the king. It's the same look every day. King cracker. Still something. A little sum of the old salad cream. Salad cream. Cheese XL. Every day we do feel. Now I'd be glad to see you back here. It will. So, is that you see his back as he's walking away from you? Something that's about it, is it? I think it is. Think it is. There's, there's a few more messages, but I don't think there's anything. Um, more. Is there anything we've got to mention on coming up? I don't think there is. Uh, uh, do you want to go through the schedule very quickly? No. Uh, we went through the schedule last week. The, the schedule covers this next two yeah. weeks. Good. And then there will be some sort of changes, but yeah. we'll be able to bring you more of that next week and let you know. So, again, look at, look at your schedule. Keep checking on Facebook. Yeah. This and the other. There might be some. Um, differences. Maria's covering some of yeah. um, Nick's sessions. Yeah. 
But yeah. so yeah. it may say Nick, but you may get Maria. But the stuff that, you, that normally goes on is still going on at yeah. the same time, etc., etc. Again, please bear with us. Sometimes things have to change. It's not. Uh, we're not trying to trick you to catch it out. But we're just being offered for very many reasons. Many reasons. Yeah. You know, could be somebody not. We've been quite stable recently. Yeah. yeah. Um, um, so, so just bear with us, and we're doing our best. So, uh, I'd like, I like to say a big old thank you to Miss Santa. Thank you very much, Chris. Yes. Double, double camera in. Big old thank, 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 thank you to Mr. Mark. Thank you. And thank you to you, Spiffalo. Big old thank you very much. It was a pleasure to have a chance. It was interesting to have a So until next week, ladies and gentlemen, on 13, next Friday, which will be the 28th, Mark. Oh, it will. From himself, from Ella, and from Mark, goodbye. Bye, guys. See you now.